this is the uh, screen of the uh, navigation system for my car. Um, it's a uh, Volvo uh, RTI, Road and Traffic Information System. Um, it's uh, 2001 to 2007, I think, model year uh, system. So it's pretty dated. It's made by uh, Mitsubishi, actually. Um, the display itself is, is really low resolution. It's uh, 400 pixels by 240 pixels. So that's uh, not much. I'm not planning on using the navigation system. Uh, navigation system is outdated. It's 15 years old now. It's, uh, it still has a DVD. And the DVD player is unable to read the DVD. It's slow. It's not up to date. And there are updates available, but even those are uh, five years old, so I'm not going to use that. So I thought I'd replace the uh, the screen and use it for something else. Uh, so I got myself a brand new screen from uh, from eBay. It's a uh, 800 by 480 pixel uh, display. Uh, so it's uh, twice the width and height in terms of pixels. Uh, so. Let's, and this fits perfectly by the way, it's the, the same dimensions, uh, I have a uh, small control board here also from eBay, uh, it has a uh, HDMI 1.2 input, uh, it has two um, AV inputs, so the old analog video. Um, there used to be a connector here, I uh, removed that because it's too bulky, instead I just uh, soldered the wires directly to the board. Uh, there's a VGA connector here that's been removed because it um, takes up too much space. Uh, same for the power um, port, I uh, unsoldered that. Also uh, too bulky, uh, instead I uh, soldered uh, two wires directly to the board. Uh, maybe I can show my... Uh, Beautiful, horrific soldering at the bottom. Uh, here is a uh, wire for the uh, uh, AV input. I'm going to use this for a backup camera. Uh, power wires and these two, uh, three wires here are for the uh, infrared receiver because this uh, control board has a uh, remote control. So I'm uh, pretty much all done here. All I have to do is uh, put everything back together. The uh, infrared LED, I uh, glued it in place here. It's uh, behind this uh, part. I'm using some uh, pieces of, I don't, I don't know what kind of material this is, but it does the job of uh, keeping the uh, display in place. The old display has the, had a bracket and it's slotted in there. and. Uh, and that kept everything uh, rigidly in place, but now I have to uh, make do with this stuff. But it seems to do the trick. It uh, absorbs any uh, vibrations. Uh, so. so, here we go. Um, now in order to prevent the board from uh, making contact with the uh, metal down here. I've uh, put a couple of pieces of felt here, which you uh, usually put uh, underneath your chair to protect your floor. So it seems to do the trick. And I have uh, another piece here that's, that goes on top of here and that prevents these pins from sh shorting out. And that also uh, provides enough of a cushion to keep everything in place. Um, this modification that I did is uh, non-permanent. You can actually revert everything uh, if you keep all the components, original components. Uh, I have a, uh, a HDMI flex cable here that's usually used in, uh, in quadcopters and, and for glasses, I think. Uh, pretty cheap, actually. And that's uh, perfect for running uh, a cable here and there's a connector here on the end. And for the uh, power and um, Analog video, I just use a normal piece of cable and I've uh, used some cable ties here to keep everything uh, in place. Um, and this works fine. Uh, I 
I'll edit, edit in a video to show this uh, going up and down and uh, the cables are not binding. That's, uh, that's cool. So let's put this puppy in place. This just... Oh, don't forget this. What's really nice about this unit is that they use the same screw everywhere. Pro tip, use a clean workbench. Uh, let's see, let's put the cover up, back on. HDMI input, and here we have our uh, power cable and our uh, analog video. Good. No signal. So here's our uh, remote, and of course no battery. Bateria. Bateria. There we go. Video select AV1, AV2, VGA, HDMI, AV1, one HDMI cable. Awesome. Next challenge. What was the password again? There we are. Just look at that. It's awesome. And we have a backup camera. eBay, four dollars. Awesome. And here we are. One backup camera. Mm. Sorry. It's a mess. It's a giant mess. Where is split screen? So yeah, it uh, seems to be working. So uh, next step is an uh, installation in the car. <laughs> 